What's up guys? Right now we are home. My baby is cooking, chefing up some food. I honestly just finished eating. Yeah, I feel like a big, how you call it? Pig. Fat hog right now. Big stomach. <laughs> he just finished eating some shrimp. I'm making me some tacos. Yeah. So what you eating with that tacos? This is gonna Check go in here. And then it's gonna go like this. And then I'm gonna make the sauce. I'm gonna put the tortilla in here and then I'm gonna cook it over there. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So it could be saucy, throw my sour cream, get some. Just got my onions, my cilantro, got all my stuff in it already. Now I just need to like get up in there. That looks good, baby. It looks really, really good. Mm. Looks good. All right, guys. So uh, I want to jump straight into this video. Uh, we never done a video like this. We really want to do a video like this. And today we are going to make it happen. So as you guys can tell by the title, today's topic is just basically going to be how we stay productive and basically consistent and organized as content creators. Yeah. Don't get us wrong. We human because there's a lot of stuff that we say we're not going to do and we end up doing it even after you say you're not gonna do it. So that's a part of it where you actually have to like write out your to-do list and your not to-do list so you don't get distracted with stuff that distracts you. And before you know it, you're like exhausted. You don't wanna end up doing anything. And one of the things, honestly, to be starting off with, one of the things that is like my pet peeve is like not knowing what I'm gonna end up cooking throughout the day because it's like, if I don't know when I'm eating and what I'm eating, then I'm like, how do you call it? Wasting time thinking about it when I could be making like bigger decisions. So mm -hmm. like my first advice was like, maybe like write out a menu or something that you know, like maybe 10 different things that you know you like cooking and then just put them on a piece of paper or something like, like this. Like this is me and Christopher's, we count our calories and our grams and everything of our food. But like this, you can put a menu on something like this. That's how easy that is. Yeah, so another thing I do want to touch on is, guys, when I wake up, I am normally on a go. Like, I'm always wanting to work, 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 work. And I found myself getting, like, really stressed. I always put my work first. And I was never really, like, putting myself first. Like, my mental health, my physical, and stuff like that. I would sometimes, like, skip the gym just to work. Got into this book. I don't remember what it's called, guys, to be honest. Yeah, and I really feel like... Usually... And I really feel like that's a no-no, too. Like, you definitely have to put your exercise into your life. Like, that's what organizing everything important means. So, now, as this... Let me actually get this book. It's... Um... It's called The Everyday Warrior, guys. So I'm reading this book and it's basically telling me to find balance, right? And it's true, guys. To be honest, you got to learn how to find balance in life. Once you have balance in life, you will achieve success. So now normally what I do, guys, is I wake up and I read, I write, I journal, um, I count my blessings, guys. I try to like do stuff around the house that's going to keep me active for a little while, probably like an hour or two. And then I start getting into work and stuff like that. But before I do that, I like kind of organize my day, like pinpointing what I'm going to do first. But usually what I do is... Is like I'll put my most top priority stuff at the top of my list and I try to make them the highest three things so to be honest like you guys know we content creators I would try to like basically put YouTube first which is our long videos TikTok second which you guys know we have like four different TikToks. We have two couple um TikToks and I have mine and Crystal has hers. We constantly like posting like massive videos. So to break it down guys, we actually record on like maybe a Sunday or a Wednesday or Saturday. We have like three different options to record to post to be uploaded on Friday. Yeah, so we'll pick our days to record basically, like depending on what days we're going to upload that week and then we know what days it is that we're going to record what days we're gonna edit and then what days we're gonna upload so that it makes it a lot easier if you really plan your day or your week it kind of makes it a lot easier for you to know what you're doing when you're doing and it just takes the question out like what am i doing it's it's honestly human mm -hmm. everybody does it and i specifically love to have my like week planned out 
just so that I could be like, okay, I did this, I did this, I did this. These things I didn't get done doesn't make me feel any worse because you're not always going to get everything done. So. so basically what we try to do guys is just make a list man it could be whatever a notepad you get your notepad and you write your most top priorities on top of the list you keep the very light stuff at the bottom so our light stuff really is like editing youtube videos and just sharing our content all over as far as that man honestly what i gotta say is just motivation is hard guys like chris who said we are human and sometimes we get our days where we supposed to record and we don't to be honest because we just like really exhausted from content and we post so much videos or something else ends up coming into the situation family or something happened mm -hmm. with the neighbor your house or it's just a lot of normal things that end up becoming a part of your day which you can't allow yourself to get like deterred or down and how do you call that how uh discouraged not like yeah deterred or slumped and stuff like that because of the fact that you can't really compare yourself to someone else you got to mm -hmm. hold yourself to your own standard and if you compare yourself to someone else then you're really never winning Exactly. You have to like you're only competing against yourself. So what I would say guys is motivation Fuck motivation guys to be honest because it's very hard the important thing you want to have in life guys is discipline and consistency That's what really matters and if you have that you will reach success and don't forget balance guys balance your life Like put your health first man make sure you work work out go out get a walk in and come back and then get straight into work guys Having mental clarity guys you'll be good trust me you'll be good your mind got to be right once your mind is right Everything around you will be right and one thing I do got to say, guys, is stop following all these pages on Instagram, showing you all these luxurious shit and planes, cars, and just basically showing off, guys. That's basically just going to get you jealous, envying that person. You're going to want to start living that person's life instead of yours. And then what's going to happen, guys, you're just going to forget about your life and just focus on someone else's life when you should be living your own freaking life and stop worrying what everybody else is doing. The reason why people are where they are today, guys, is because they focus on themselves and they didn't worry about anybody else. Just focus on yourself, guys. Don't worry about anybody else. Trust me, you will get there. Me and Crystal, honestly, we post content, we go hard, and we focus on ourselves. We focus on our growth. We go back. Yeah, not everybody's life is perfect. And this goes back to me saying, like, you have to compare yourself to yourself because only you can really make yourself happy. Like mm -hmm. find the things that make you happy, that make you feel successful. And you do those things instead of thinking, oh, I got to do what this person's doing. Or I got to act like this person's acting. Like, no, be your own person. Be you. Yeah. So, guys, basically, again, just a recap of everything we just said. I wake up. Be honest. The first thing I do is find balance. When I'm done with my morning routine, guys, I sit down and I journal. I read and write you already know we do a lot of content youtube goes first we put one video on youtube we got like six tiktoks we do at the same time we post we edit we gotta cook we gotta clean basically guys how we stay organized is just write shit down simple simple as that just make your life easy write shit down whatever comes to your head write it down sometimes guys trying to like really execute your list will get overwhelming sometimes so do your best on executing your list top priorities and you know if you didn't finish your list guys just thank god that you lived another day you achieved most of the shit on your list and you know tomorrow's another day oh guys these are my tortillas it has like the egg inside of it which is not vegan but with the vegan meat and some sour cream toasted on the outside with the sauce that like i used that i made and then just yeah that's my taco all right guys so if y'all want to see more videos like this and y'all really want to see us like show y'all what we really do in a day just comment below and let us know and we'll be glad to show y'all what type of videos we do and reality guys just show you what we do throughout our day and videotape it and try to be as raw as we can with you guys so again guys y'all already know man it's your boy chris and we love you and we are guys peace